This is stock number 20J220. We are here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee headquarters. Today we are checking out this brand new 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland High Altitude Edition. This vehicle has the award-winning 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor. It is in slate blue metallic. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, or smartphone device, turn them on right now because it is definitely your best way to check out the styling and looks and color of the vehicle before seeing it in person. If you want to check out all the photos on this Jeep in the upper right hand part of your screen is a link right to our website, click that and check us out there. This one's going to come with the Prelly Scorpion 265.50 R20 tires, comes with the granite crystal painted alloy rims, part of that high altitude package. And that's kind of a highway terrain uh, tread pattern on there. Slate blue metallic, really a good looking color. They came out with this a couple years ago. Has the HID headlamps, the LED running lights, the LED fog lamps, and running lights down there. Front bumper parking sensors. It also has the adaptive cruise control. Take note of the granite crystal bumper inserts around the bezels there and on the seven slotted grill here, the inserts on there. Also the Jeep logo is that granite crystal color as well. Get the blacked out Cherokee lettering outlined in the granite crystal as well. This one has the enter and go system. We're gonna take a look at the original window sticker here. Feel free to pause this, I'm not gonna go through all the options, but uh, we'll just check out the basics here. Slate blue is a 245 option. The high altitude package, which is a 2BS, is a 2745 package, and it shows you everything that you get with that high altitude package, including the um, Protect 2 stuff with the adaptive cruise control and parallel park assist and lane departure and all that good stuff. Um, you also get ProTech 1 standard, which is the backup camera, parking sensors, and blind spot cross path detection. Total MSRP is 54,180. Highway 25 miles per gallon, 18 city, 21 average. And my favorite part about the Grand Cherokees is the safety rating up and down. Um, five and four stars, five star overall. Very safe vehicle that you're going to want to put your family in. And um, they really uh, have done well with the Grand Cherokees you know, on this particular body style. And because it's been around a little while, this uh, body style definitely has all the kinks worked out, you know, not gonna run into too many problems uh, with, you know, this particular Jeep. It does have the towing package, receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. It has the power lift gate, the granite crystal Jeep lettering on the back. There is the cover for that, um, receiver hitch. It's got two little pop pins on springs there. Factory subwoofer in here. And you also get a full size spare tire. Those seats do fold down for extra storage. It does have the sunshade as well, which is a really nice feature. If you got groceries or something, you want to keep them cool out of the sun. You know, it's also a kind of a safety device as well. You know, if you've got expensive stuff, computers, whatnot, put them under here. And then uh, it's kind of out of sight, out of mind type deal. Nobody's going to break into your car to steal something they can't see. Anyways, this power lift gate powers down like that. Pre press it, beeps at you three times, comes on down, actually beeps a total of four. Speaking of four, you got the four by four and the taillight bezels grayed out as well. And coming down the driver's side here, it does have the capless fuel fill, four wheel disc brakes on the Grand Cherokees, of course. And, um, like I said, the enter and go system, you do get that blind spot monitoring in the mirror. They are heated and you get the LED built in directional signals. Inside the high altitude package gives you the black leather interior. And now if this was an Overland, it would have, or just an Overland, it would have the Overland stitched in there. But because you get the high altitude, you get the uh, full leather backing there. Both these seats are heated and cooled. Driver's side lumbar factory floor mats throughout. 
power windows, power locks, power mirrors, memory driver seat, and you get the black rose grain, wood grain trim on there. The, also the black bezels around the handles and the air vents, auto headlamps, power tilt, and telescopic steering wheel. You get the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, outside temp and compass. Um, really a nice setup and you can adjust pretty much all this stuff in the corner and uh, control it with the steering wheel with these buttons right here. Leather wrap steering wheel, it's heated, cruise controls on the right, adaptive cruise controls on the bottom there, and then Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. This one has the 8.4 4C radio. I'm gonna close the sunshade here on the panel roof. Um, so the 8.4 4C radio, AM, FM, Sirius XM radio capabilities. It also has these off-road pages. I got it on there just because sometimes it takes a second for those to load, but you get your steering angle, which is really cool. Um, your transfer case, if you're in four-wheel drive or two-wheel drive, you also have your suspension. Uh, because it's the Quadra lift suspension, you can raise it up and uh, you just press it up. Just press that button right there and you can see it's actually raising. And I don't know if you can see it. But... So now you're in off-road one mode. Um, so that's pretty cool stuff there. You also have your pitch and your roll your accessory gauges, and then your select terrain. So now going back to this QuadraTrack 2 system, if you do the sand, snow, mud, or rock, and you turn that, it'll actually change in your seven inch cluster here, that sand, snow, and then mud. And then if you want to do rock, you got to put it in four wheel drive low. But we're just going to go back to auto. Anyways, um, you also have your factory navigation system on here. You can also do Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, part of that projection manager right there. So that's a really neat system where you can project your cell phone to the screen. Also music and stuff and then control your cell phone through the screen. It's really cool stuff. Has a backup camera. Those are dynamic grid lines that turn as you turn the steering wheel. And that center line, it lines up right with your uh, receiver hitch. So if you're hooking up to a boat or a camper or something, it makes it really easy to do. Now you got your climate controls here as well. You got dual climate controls and you also have your heated and cooled seats and heated steering wheel buttons. Now if you don't like using the screen up here, don't worry. You can use the climate controls down here as well as the audio controls for the more tactile buttons. Um, also we have the perpendicular and parallel park assist. That's for your parking sensors. You can turn those off and on. That's for your lane departure, your start stop capabilities your eco mode, sport mode, and your stability control. You do get two USBs and an AUX jack underneath there. And then you get your keyless entry here with the remote start. Eight speed automatic transmission. You get that wood grain trim all along the dash there. Up here you got your home link buttons, map lights, and uh, this is also your sunroof and sun shade controls. So, I'm going to show you that opens up just the front there and then that goes all the way to the back. That's a fixed glass rear window. We're going to take a quick look at the back seats. Um, kind of running low on time here. But back seats, lots of room back here. You do get the latch child safety system. These back seats are heated as well and you get two USBs and 115 volt, 150 watt plug in back here. These seats do fold down almost completely flat, which is nice if you got to haul a bunch of extra stuff. And you do get the child safety locks in the back doors. I'm going to do one more quick walk around here of the car or of the Jeep so that you can get a good look and feel for that slate blue color. Thanks for checking out the video. I hope you enjoyed it and learned a little bit about this particular Jeep Grand Cherokee. And to see more pictures of this Jeep Grand Cherokee or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Grand Cherokees, you name it, we got it. Go to our website, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel on your left, a link to more Grand Cherokee videos like this one on your right. If you have not been to our website, on the bottom, a link to this vehicle on our website. Click those, check us out. And we're super excited to be offering the 2020 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland High Altitude Edition in Slate Blue Metallic. Thanks for checking out the video.